And there's the opening bell. Round number one, scheduled for four. This one is expected to be a thriller. Teddy, I find it unrealistic that this guy's got much of a chance against this power puncher. Hey, that doesn't make you Notre Dame is there, Joe. Andre Bishop getting to his opponent's head. Nice job by Bishop with the power shot. So right from the start in this fight, he's committed to the body shots. Well, that's the time to go there right at the beginning because body work pays off for you later in the fight. No sense in wasting time. Get right to it. Bishop's power has been shown off early on in his fights. Teddy, what effect could his power have early in this fight? Well, if he catches his opponent, it could be an early night. But if he catches his opponent and his opponent survives it, guess what? It could be a long night, fam. That is a big right hand after eating one himself. Able to land the hook to the head. Here's one for you now, he says. Right back with the left hand. Solid right by Andre Bishop. The combo lands upstairs. How about a return to sender with the left hand? Good looking uppercut that time. Scoring with the right hand by Andre Bishop. He's got confidence he can crack, and he just did there. And he had the distance, Joe, the height that he wanted to set up that punch. That's it. Joel Savone's getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Are you going to let your hands go? You have to. You have to be busy. This, this guy is beating the shit out of you. You have to throw three or four punches in a row. You can turn this around, but you gotta let it go. All right. All right. Deep breath. Nice work. Nice work. You're in control. Keep doing what you're doing. You're in control. Keep making those. Hey, listen. I'm not gonna stand here and watch you take these shots. You understand me? Let's see some defense and more punches. I got more. Right, kid. Let's have your skills on the present day. Oh my God, Dre. This is your fight. Oh my God. You're in control of you, Dre. Here we go. Round two is underway. If things stay this way, Andre Bishop is going to coast into victory. He has a considerable lead against Joel Savone. Very accurate two-punch combo by Andre Bishop. Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here tonight? Well, two aspirin and then go... Oh, no. <laughs> Actually, I would say a little counterpunching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription for him. Halfway through round number two. Overhand right can be so effective. The other day when we were talking to Andre Bishop, he said to have success in this fight, I have to land combinations. He landed a good one there. Joel Savone is able to land a good, solid left hand. He scored well after being hit himself. Oh, and he's got something for him himself, and it's a left hand. It seems to me that Bishop is right now uncomfortable with the pace that's being set in this fight. Well, he started the pace. See, that's the funny thing about it. He said it, but he might not be able to keep it up. That is exactly what the corner wanted to see. A good combination punch by Andre Bishop. Comes right back at him with a left hand. He has his target. He lands a straight right. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. 
position. Just being smart on the outside. Savone's lack of defense, especially when it comes with just getting away from that right hand, is really costing him a lot here. Well, it's pretty simple. The old timers would say, move your head, otherwise your opponent will move it for you. And we come to the end of round number two. Listen to me, man. If you want this fight, you know, better, much better. You gotta keep the pressure up on this team. Keep your hands free, all right? Throw that in. I got more. All right, throw that in there. You gotta breathe. Breathe. Relax. How are you feeling out there? You gotta watch the water in the Breathe. In the Breathe through your lungs, very good, very good. You look very good, that's it. You know, just like training, okay? Focus. Let's go. What are you waiting for? You want this fight? Now let's get moving out here. This guy's gonna win this. And round number three is underway. I really like what Andre Bishop is doing here. He's scoring well against the veteran Savone. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by Andre Bishop. Bishop's left now getting into the mix. It's all right, keep moving. Wow, is he defensively sound. Takes one, gives one. The right hand scores well. Savone's not having things go his way tonight, but there's one easy explanation for it. He's barely moving. He's just stationary there. And his opponent's taking great advantage of that. He's coming in. He's... Let's see if Bishop can survive. Big shot there. Andre Bishop is on the receiving end of a power shot that scored the knockdown. What guts by Andre Bishop. We've seen it throughout his career we've been following, but he wants to fight on here. Keep doing what you oh, that's a big oh. shot to the head. Return to sender. He gives him back one of his own. Uh, the old-timers love that right there. The right hand and the left hook to the head. And Banking away a body shot with the right hand. Savone's left landing well. He is not in good shape. He could be on the deck. Wow! We've been watching this roller coaster ride of the career of Andre Bishop for so long. Now another dip. Can he rise up and continue on? Andre Bishop rises to his feet. But of course, Gus is experienced enough to know now when he gets back to the corner, he has a job to do. Not just dump cold water on him to revive him, but to tell him what he got hit with. Remove that fear a little bit from his mind that it will happen again. He can correct the mistake. Just a dominating evening by Andre Bishop tonight. He is clearly up big on the scorecards. Trainer Gus Carissi has to know it. You can just see by the way he's dealing with him in between rounds. He knows it, and he can go two ways with it. Get the rounds out, work on things, carry him a little bit, or go close to show. Deep breath. Yes, sir. Good. Okay. Three. Now listen. You threw a wide punch and he caught you. Tight. Listen to me. You're not giving me enough punches, okay? One more punch. Jack. Relax, relax, relax. God, relax. You gotta move out. Move, move, move. Breathe. Come on, breathe. Breathe. You doing it good? There you go, you doing it good. Final round for Andre Bishop in a fight that's really been a walk through the park with how supremely skilled he is. There were so many doubters of Andre Bishop coming into this fight, but right now he's silencing them as he is leading the way against Joel Savone. Bishop's showing us that he is sticking with the game plan, but keep in mind, that game plan had him down earlier in this fight. What would you be telling him right now, Teddy? Well, first of all, you got to explain to him very quickly and very clearly 
why he got caught. You could still do the other things. The other things that we thought going into this fight is still going to work. But make an adjustment. It's not that you didn't do the thing that could work. You didn't do it properly. That's okay, oh, that's, that's good cool. stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by Andre Bishop. Savone's showing a little bit of a defensive shell, but Teddy, I'm seeing punches still getting through and splitting that guard. Yeah, well, that's the problem, Joe, when you put those earmuffs on, but you don't move your head. Some of them are going to get through, and just as importantly, you handcuff yourself, so your opponent is going to stay in there a little bit longer, knowing that nothing's coming back right away. That's a nice right hand that time by Andre Bishop. Boy, right on target with that double jab. Andre Bishop getting back to basics, landing that right hand. And now you see the southpaw pulling this good power punch. The right hand landed. And just like that, big shot. How about that? He goes from being the victim to handing out the punishment. One, two, three, four, five. Hard to prepare for a situation like this, but many do. He's been down. Now he's got to survive. So that's where you're wrong. It's not hard to prepare. It's a must to prepare. If you're what a big shot. And he beat the count? I don't think so here, Teddy. Now I know where they got that saying. Falling like a sack of potatoes. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And the dream for Andre Bishop becomes a nightmare. A knockout loss. Number 10 now in the books for Joel Savone. Once again, a gold medalist at these World Amateur Games.